Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome to Frag the Planet. So, it's Arms Day, October 28th, 2015. And this video is um, just about the... I ordered all the guns last week from the gunsmith, so I'm just going to go over the, the guns that I picked like the big one. from the ones that I ordered. And um, I hope you guys ordered the scout rifle last week because it is a monster roll today. So... Uh, the first time I did this video, I forgot to switch my mic on. Let's talk. And, unfortunately, I already grabbed all the guns from the gunsmith because Dark I thought I was there. recording my voice. So, Until I'll just show you the ones time. that I picked in my inventory here. Um, for the Judith D, I went with uh, Army of One and Feeding Frenzy. I think it's the best out of all the other ones. The other ones had, like... Um, uh, motion tracker and stuff like that. I don't really like motion tracker because it's not third eye. So you can only use motion tracker if you're not looking down sights. So not really good. But I like Army of One Feeding Frenzy. It had speed reload, explosive rounds, and uh, reinforced barrels. So a lot of different choices. Um, different perks that you could put on this gun to try different things out. So that's the Judith D. Uh, for the Ufern HC4, I went with um, Zen Moment and Triple Tap. Not so much because of these main perks, but because Extended Mag and Reinforced Barrel. Um, I want to try those out. Um, having only 7 rounds in a hand cannon is kind of not really that great. And we'll have to see what Extended Mag, mag brings it up to, but... If it doesn't bring it up like over 10, I probably won't use this hand cannon. I'll probably dismantle it. There's just better choices out there. Um, they kind of killed hand cannons, so hopefully they'll bring them back at some point. But, um, for the Lyad Milla, I went with Army of One and Full Auto. This one also has Hand Loaded, which is pretty good. Single Point Sling, which is pretty good for PvP. This might be a pretty decent gun. I like the thermal imaging scope because it highlights all enemy targets. This one is a high impact, slow rate of fire pulse rifle, kind of like the Nerwin's Mercy and the Hopscotch and the Messenger. Um, it does fire, the rounds really aren't grouped that close together, so the mid range in Crucible is a little rough. Um, if you can get into like close range or Maybe just a little bit farther out from, like... If, if you can kind of hang around in auto-rifle territory with this, um, I think it'll work really well. And it fires that extra round, too. So it actually fires four. And it has uh, 36 in the magazine, which is pretty decent. That's pretty dang high for a pulse rifle. Probably the highest I've seen. Um, for the rocket launcher... Let the dead sleep I the like trade, eh, the tracking... Um, that's going to be pretty good for PvE. For PvP, I like the Grenades and Horseshoes, the proximity one. But I'm actually going to hang on to this and see what kind of rolls I get next week. Because I already have a tracking one that I picked up a couple weeks ago. Uh, the Cluster one might be decent PvE, I'm not sure. I could try it, but I really honestly haven't been using rocket launchers. I've just been using heavy machine gun um because they just the rocket launchers just do not seem to even hold a candle against the heavy machine gun, guns Guardian. and i really hope you guys order the scout rifle the soros dis 43 because this week is it's one of the best pvp looking rolls i've seen uh hammer forged increased range a pendant magazine, so you could have higher magazine if you wanted to. Full auto, like, this thing hits hard. Um, it is a kind of a lower rate of fire scout, but it has high impact. So it's generally like a two headshot gun. It's just going to be a beast with full auto. I can't wait to try it out. Snapshot is a great PvP perk. And hand laid stock is awesome, especially um, paired with full auto. Hand laid stock will give you that stability so it's not like recoiling all over the place. So I really hope you guys ordered it. If you didn't, you can order it again this week. Um, so it's good to know we can actually get those rolls. 
you can actually get full auto on it. So if you didn't get it, definitely order it for next week. Keep that so those are my picks for October 20th, 2015. I really hope uh, you guys liked the video. Um, if you did, please hit like. And uh, if you want to see more of these in the future, go ahead and hit subscribe. All right, guys, thanks, Excellent. and take it easy. Dream,